Imagine jumping into the air as high as you can. No matter how hard you try, you always come back down. That's because of gravity, the invisible force that pulls everything toward Earth. Gravity is what keeps our feet on the ground, makes apples fall from trees, and even holds the moon in orbit around our planet. But gravity doesn't just exist on Earth, it's everywhere in space, shaping the way planets, moons, and stars move. Gravity is what gives things weight. The stronger the gravity, the more something weighs. On Earth, gravity pulls with a certain strength, giving objects a specific weight. But in space, where gravity is much weaker, things can feel almost weightless. That's why astronauts float around in the International Space Station. They are still being pulled toward Earth, but because they are in constant freefall, they don't feel their weight. Gravity depends on two things, mass and distance. The bigger an object is, the stronger its gravitational pull. That's why the sun's gravity is strong enough to keep all the planets in orbit. But distance matters too. The farther away you are from a planet or star, the weaker its gravitational pull. That's why astronauts on the moon feel so light. They're standing on a smaller body with much less mass than Earth, so the pull of gravity is weaker. Gravity is what holds the solar system together. The Earth orbits the Sun because of the Sun's gravity, and the Moon orbits Earth for the same reason. Even asteroids and comets follow paths shaped by gravity, pulling them toward planets or sending them flying through space. Without gravity, everything would float away into nothingness. The next time you drop something, feel yourself standing on the ground, or watch a video of astronauts floating in space, remember, it's all because of gravity, the force that gives everything weight and keeps the universe in motion.